everyone, it's Mangaminx here, and guess what we're playing? We're playing something that you guys have been looking forward to for a while. I think it was one of my most popular Let's Plays I've ever done, uh, the first instalment of this, so uh, let's hope it continues in doing well. We're going to play Harvey's New Eyes in English. Let's go. This is Edna and Harvey, Harvey's New Eyes. Start with a new game. I know nothing about this at all. Oh, I have needle and stitch right here. Take care or you'll end up scarred, my dear. I can't stand to watch children bleed. Okay, there was a very lengthy Hello intro there. To your friends of Adventure Games. Hello there. The spyware we installed on your computers tells me that many children are sitting at their screens again tonight. <laughs> That's why I'll refrain from telling you the story that I had actually prepared for you. Of course, that's a real shame. It would have been such a good Children story. ruin everything for Entertaining everyone. Entertaining explosions, a giant robotic opossum. But also with many offensive expressions and an inordinate amount of excessive violence. The story that I'll tell you instead has a slightly different... Oh, boo. It's about Lily, the most virtuous child in the entire I'm world. I'm sure she is. And it begins in the courtyard of a small, sleepy convent A convent, of course. Not too far from the place where the giant robotic opossum is sucking the brains of innocent bystanders out through their eyes. I want to see that. But enough okay, of that. Yeah. It's a beautiful Let's sunny Let's focus day. on the story, guys. And Lily is raking the leaves in the yard with a cheery tune on her lips. Uh. La, 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 la. It's beautiful, Lily. Lily, how many times do I have to tell you not to sing while That's working? extremely you sinful. You know very well that I hate the sound of cheerful children. These ch 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 children are driving me crazy. She's a bitch. That's right, Lily. Keep on whistling. Keep on whistling. Chapter one is the convent, guys. Let's do this. Hi, Edna. How you doing? Oh, there you are. Is that Moloch making you rip, 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 rake leaves again? Uh huh. Tuh. How boring, and so unnecessary, too. Damn right. The leaves all drift back onto the path anyway. You should just come with me instead. I'm on a treasure hunt right Listen now. Listen to Edna. Uh-uh. Well, it's your decision. You can always come to the swing tree later, when you're done here. I think I found something in the flower beds over there. To the body. Until then, see ya. Bye, Edna. We'll talk to you later. Aww, Millie's all sad. And here's our there tutorial. Are frequent reports of accidents caused by the mishandling of computer games. To minimize the risk of a crippling deformity, we recommend that you strictly comply with all of the following safety guidelines. I'll try and do that tutorial, man. Do you want to play the tutorial? Uh, do we want to play the tutorial or not? I'm actually going to go no because I know what I'm doing. We can rake leaves as happily as we ever have. Okay, Lily, calm down. You're getting a bit overexcited with those leaf raking at the moment. Go on, rake them all up. Come on, you can do it. There we go. It's alright, keep going, keep going. There we go. All in one nice big pile. Mission accomplished. We're having the best time in the whole wide world right now, guys. Well, I'm not actually... Maybe I should have done the tutorial, because for some reason, I can't walk or anything, or do anything in particular at all. Just keep breaking them, I guess. Gotta pass the time somehow. Okay, well, this isn't going too well. What are you going to do with a stone stab? What's that noise outside? Oh, it's a bear! 
Keep doing it. Keep doing it. Lily, now I've had it up to here. I guess I overestimated you once again. You're not even fit to rake me. Oh, I said. Make us do uh, something else. It doesn't matter. I have two new tasks. Awesome. For you. The flower beds in the backyard have to be dug up again. Can you manage that? Uh huh. I doubt it, but we'll see. And while you're in the backyard, the swing tree is infested by termites. Come up with something to get rid of them for good. So, one more time for the really clueless. Okay. First, dig up the flower. I am really clear this. Second. Get rid of the termites infesting swing tree. You'll be very sorry if you don't do a good job. Considering how dark the first game is, and this one's actually meant to be a ton worse, I'm really interested in seeing where this goes. Anyway, what's in the cellar window? We can now actually look around. Can we go down here? Got a brush? The idea was good. But Lily's arms were too short. Oh, looks like we need someone to try and help us the get things. The idea was good, but Lily's arms were too short. Can I inspect things as well? Lily knew that this device was called an air hammer. Pretty simple, but controls. she didn't know why anyone would want to hammer air. Well, sometimes air just needs a fucking lesson taught. You know, we got a ball of wool, a rake, and a brush. Can we use the rake to grab anything else? Anything else? Nothing else is really in range, is it? The idea was good. Okay. Let's leave this now. We have a brush. And does the space bar thing work? It does. Too, too bad. The faucet was dry. Oh, okay. Got a garden hose. Oh. Maybe we can, like, do something with this. Like... What did we just do? Oh, so maybe we can flood the cellar and stuff later on. Okay, that's cool. Plenty of things going on here. Lily was excited. Where could the hose lead to? It's all very exciting. What a surprise. The hose led to a thing. Thank you, Mr. Narrator. You're being very helpful here. <laughs> Okay, we can't misbehave here, it seems, at the moment. We need to find a way of getting into the cellar. Can we smash it open with the rake? Because that's what I'd do if I was Lily. Smash it open with a rake. The cellar door could only be opened with the correct key. Okay, that's fine. Let's head off to the backyard. To the well, to the backyard, okay. Let's go find Edna. It's been a long time since we spoke to her last. Oh, there she is. She's having a great time, look. Edna, what's going on? Hey, Lily. Hi. Did you finally get out of doing your stupid raking chore? Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Very uh -huh. good. Then you finally got time to go treasure hunting with me? Uh-huh. Uh -huh. What? Did you get even more chores to do? Uh-huh. Uh -huh. That's so unfair. But maybe we can still find a way for you to help me. Uh -huh. That would be cool. Okay, so what do you need doing? Chores assigned by Mother Okay, so there's options. Do a treasure hunt. Chores assigned by Mother Superior. Mother Superior. Uh -huh. Oh, I talk. I'm sure you're dying to know how the treasure hunting's going. Damn right. right. Uh huh. Well, to be honest, not so great. Aww. The ground is just too hard. Okay. I doubt I'll be able to find anything here without a shovel. But I already have lots of cool dirt under my fingernails, and I even swallowed a slug by accident. Oh, Edna. A small consolation from Mother I've missed you so much, you know. You and your murdering ways. What do you have to do for Mother Superior now? Don't tell me you have to scrape off her warts with a pumice stone again. I'm still finding crumbs in our Oh, bone that is disgusting. Time. Okay, so termites. Uh, she told you to get rid of the termites on the swing tree, right? Uh huh. <sighs> it was just a question of time. Does she even realize how hard it was to collect them? <laughs> she put them there. She even broke into the firefighters' museum to get the large <laughs> red ones. And then all the trouble I went to teaching them tricks. They can already do a polonaise if you lay a trail of jelly. Where's the jelly? I wanted to teach them the cha-cha next. Ugh, <sighs> what the hell. Maybe you can relocate them instead of blasting them out, or whatever else it was you had planned. I'd even help you, but I've run out of jelly. Okay, we gotta find some jelly. Um... Are you still worried about the termites? Yes, I wanna find I out where really the jelly is. I'd love to help you, but unfortunately, 
I don't have any but when we found the tread or even better a honey farm I think honey is much cooler than jelly and anyway. she's so totally it delusional to the bottoms of your shoes better and if we had a honey farm we could also train the bees maybe there's still a oh my god my project peep holes for the Great Wall of China after all oh god she's crazy okay to go flab it uh oh wait Lily this is an especially hard spot oh what a drag this is ruining all my calluses and it took me so long to nurse she's crazy them. Ed is These crazy flower beds could really use some digging uh-huh don't tell me that's exactly what Mother Superior ordered you to do uh-huh uh -huh. But that's fabulous. And you'll be able to help me dig up the treasure after We can bind us. We don't even have a choice. You've been kind of told to by the Lord. All we still need is a shovel. Okay, so where am I going? Okay, we need those things. Uh, just ask her about Mother Superior, I guess. <sighs> Mother Superior is having a bad day again, She's a isn't bitch. Uh-huh. That wasn't hard to guess. The last good day she had was when everyone got mugged. <laughs> I've rarely heard her laugh so hard. Don't let her annoy you too She's much. She's lovely. Okay. Okay, anyway, let's uh, let's have a look around, shall we? What else do we have here? Flower bed. We've got some compost barrels here. Let's have a look at those. The yard waste was rotting away leisurely in the composting bin. A paradise for maggots and spiders. Lovely. Beautiful. Lily couldn't stop watching the fascinating activity in there. I don't think I really want to do that. Let's look at tire swing instead. Lily would have loved to have played on the completely harmless <laughs> tire swing. That's why she immediately climbed on the termite infested tree. No. Uh-uh. At least she would have done that. No. But apparently she preferred the risk of getting into deep trouble as soon as the players signed off. Uh, that's pretty funny. It's it's really well written as as before. Hello, tree. How you doing? Okay, so we need some things to interact with those, okay? Let's go back to the pond and check out the other side. Does this have, like, fast travel? Yes, it does. Okay, cool. Makes life a lot easier. Don't know who this is. A bee's nest? Well. Go find another place to play. He's very nice. Oh, sweet. Apparently, Freeman was worried about this. Okay, anyway, let's, uh... I'm not sure what we can do with this once we, like, uh... Hey, get lost! Go find another place Oh, we play. can't shoot the How hose. Sweet. Ah, blah, blah, blah. Hey, get lost! Go find... How sweet. Apparent, maybe... Okay, we need to get rid of him. Uh... Hmm? Oh, Lily. I thought somebody was there. Don't bug me. I'm busy. This guy's a douchebag. What's he doing? Uh, Didn't I tell you to leave me alone? I'm trying to concentrate. What's in the well? Okay? Just tell me. Something is down there in the well. I can see something sparkling. I'm maybe it's. Oh man, I hope it's the key to the cellar. That would be so gumbo. What does that even mean, so gumbo? Gumbo? <laughs> Let me guess. Oh God! You know what gumbo is, it's made right? up. Uh -uh. Oh Lily, you're just hopelessly square. Guys as cool as me say that's totally gumbo, or that gumbo's. But you're just like what an absolute totally dish. What a dish. Let's get rid of him somehow. Uh, sell keys for what? Um, really, Lily? Unless, of course, you have an idea how I can get the cellar. I know how to get it. Just think of all the things I can We fill the well up with that. I hear that awesome stuff is stored down there. Not just junk like shovels and brushes and all that. I'm talking about real treasures. I think that's pretty much what we need to uh, to get hold of. Uh, convent rolls. Um. Is this going to be another one of your lectures about law and order? And the Damn right it is, Dish. I'm so interested. Uh... Well then. What now? Can't you see I'm busy with the well? Or did your oh so great mother superior forbid that too? <laughs> uh-huh. Oh yeah? That just proves how absurd adults rule. Oh, he's not gonna listen to us, I don't think. The well is deep. What? You're still here? Don't creep around like that. I almost fell in the well from front. Push him in. Oh, how cute. Are you worried about me now? Push what? him in. Kill him. Don't worry. 
I'm not stupid. I'm not gonna climb down into the well. Yes, but are. not because Mother Superior has forbidden it. Just because it really is too dangerous. Although... Hmm. I don't know what he's thinking about. I think he's getting to climb down. Chores. Mm. Don't you have anything to... Isn't there something you're supposed to be doing for Mother Superior? Uh-huh. <laughs> Fucking help I me. Knew it. Help me, Dave. You're such a loser for getting constantly stuck with those jobs. What is it this time? Do you have to alphabetically sort the compost <laughs> again? Again? Or remove the hair from the oh, back? Oh, that's disgusting. Get rid of termites. Don't tell me. You're supposed to get rid of the termites on the swing tree, right? Uh-huh. <laughs> well, good luck. It's all right, we're going to kill him. The swing tree's made of sweet licorice. And termites are known for going crazy over That's here. why I need the honey. You'll never I want the honey. Give me the honey. Let me guess. You have to dig up the flower beds, right? Yes, I did. <laughs> well, good luck. That's gonna take forever with your little girly hands. But don't think I'll lend you a shovel when I get into oh, the cellar. Such a dish. That is, unless you do want to help me get the key from the bottom of the well. I did. Uh -uh. Oh. That's what I thought. Because it's forbidden, right? Oh, man, Lily. You're so straight, it's a miracle anyone can tell you apart from the oh, trees. Oh, zing. He zinged us. He zinged us. Proper good there. Right, okay, so there is actually a lot we can do here by the looks of things. The well was deep. Shut up. No place for a good girl like Lily to play. So what are we going to do with our... We've got a brush. Go find a... I really want to knock that on his head. I really want to knock it on his head. We should be able to knock it on his head. It would be amazing. No thanks. I can do it myself. Give the garden hose to Freeman. No thanks. I can do it. Fine. Go fuck yourself, dude. Hmm. That didn't sound good. Hey, help! When Lily returned to the well, Freeman All right, was he gone. can't understand where he's gone. I mean, he pretty clearly has gone nowhere. Anyway, let's get this thing and now he's gone. Oh, ah, what's going on? Oh shit. Lily, no! Go away! Go away! <laughs> I'm allergic! <laughs> oh no. Clumsy Lily had actually dropped the bee's nest into the well. The bees didn't like it too much either. Their buzzing sounded different than usual. I think they're a bit upset. Uh, let's pick up the garden hose then anyway and uh, put it in the well. And then we're going to go back down here. The problem is how are we going to like uh, attach it to anything else? Like what do we attach it to? The pump? Perfection. Lily! Have you completely lost your mind? Turn that off immediately. But did I not tell you exactly what you should be We're doing? We're fixing things, don't worry. I just c c can't believe you keep finding new ways to disappoint Stop me. Stop stammering. We're fixing things, don't worry. Lily didn't understand what she had done wrong. Lily is the nicest girl in the whole world, that's why. And there we go. <laughs> Lily thought about collecting the honey with her bare hands. But then she remembered her recent scolding at the cafeteria. Okay. She needed a better plan. Fortunately, I have a better plan. We get a brush and we get it on the bee. Okay, perfect. Let's talk to Freeman. Um. Ah, Lily, <laughs> thanks a lot for your great help. You really did a fantastic job. If I can ever help you. Uh, oh, you want the He's not going to give it to us, I don't think. Of course not. What in the world are you thinking? You're the one who got me to go into the well. It's your fault that I fell no, in. No, it's not. But instead of helping uh, me get out, you throw a beehive on my you head. You are a dish. And nearly drown you me. are a dish. Look at You're me. You're a dish. I'm wet, covered in bee stings, and smeared from head to toe with honey. I know everyone thinks you're sweet and harmless. <laughs> But you're actually a walking disaster. You can definitely forget about the. I'll sort things out, guys. Don't worry. Keep away from me. Okay, we'll worry about this later on. We're gonna uh, get the key in a bit. We're gonna go and do the honey thing with the termites next. Not quite sure what the plan is gonna be, but I'm sure I'll figure it out. 
honey brush on the compost barrel. It's worth a try. The compost bin was the ideal place to move the termites to. Lily started right away. Damn right I did, because I'm a genius. With my invisible brush. And off they go, having a great time. So far, the plan had worked well. Maybe a little too well. The termites were now following Lily's oh God. spilled honey back into the... Oh, it's on the dude! <laughs> It's all right. Strange sounds were drifting towards her from over He's only dead, it'll be fine. It was probably the termites celebrating their new home. Oh, it says Edna and Lily on the tree as well. They're bestest friends in the whole wide world. Freeman had now left for good, but at least the termites had found a new home on the beach. Oh my God! If that weren't reason enough to be happy, they had been joined by one of those <sighs> that Lily sometimes saw around. Oh my god! Oh my god! We're taking the Silver King! That's his intestines, guys. Lovely. I can't look at any of this, I don't think. No. Oh, no, yeah. I'm gonna leave them there. They're having a good time. Termites are having a great time. After all, they did eat a really Most annoying cat. The has strictly forbidden the children from playing in the cellar. On the other hand, Lily had a task to finish. Damn right she did. Into the cellar we go. Uh, well, let's get the air hammer, first of all. Always need an air hammer. A shovel. That's exactly what Lily needed. Anything else worth taking in here? A can of food? Lily got along great with Doris, the lunch lady. Lovely. That's why she knew Doris would start throwing knives if anyone messed up her pantry. Oh, she sounds like a lovely understanding woman, you know, like most of the characters in this world usually are. The stove was black and empty. Just like the mirror that <laughs> appeared in Lily's dreams. This is amazing! As you can tell, we know this game was going to be great, guys. It's just really funny already. Okay, so. Now we have the spade to do the flower bed. Yay! You found a shovel! Oh, Lily, you're the best! We are the best ever! Let's not waste any time and dig up the treasure. I reckon we're going to dig up Harvey. Is what I think is going to happen. Edna and Lily began digging out what they thought was a treasure chest. That's quite a treasure chest. Is it a it bomb? Looks like it might have belonged to some space pirates. It's a bomb. Once. So what? They were space pirates from World War II. Who cares? <laughs> What's more important is that they left us their treasure. Yeah. Come on, let's open it. I'm so excited. Let's open it up. It'll be fine. Come on, let's. <clears throat> That's not gonna work. Once again. More proof that the bad reputation raw violence has is completely Damn right, undeserved. Edna. She says such Here, insightful we things. Certainly won't get far without it. Insightful things. We're gonna use the air hammer on the bomb. In fact, before we do, before we do that, I'm gonna. How do I save my game? Save. There we go. Continue playing. I'm gonna use the uh, hammer on the bomb. Great! Now the device should have enough oomph to open the treasure chest. Off we go. What's the matter? What are you waiting it's for? It's not a good idea. Don't you know how to use it's it? It's not a good idea. Uh -huh. Ah, don't worry. We'll find something else. I don't really know what we're going to use to get into this, guys. It seems like it's uh, a really, 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 really... What else can we use to get into the bomb? Hmm. I really don't know everyone. But what I do know is that Gnome is adorable and everything will be fine with him around, you know? Okay, I think this has been a good enough intro episode for Edna and Harvey, Harvey's new eyes, even though Lily appears to be the main character instead of Edna here. Um we will soon find out what lies inside the aerial bomb, I guess, and uh I hope you guys will join me in the next installment. If you enjoyed part one, it is a new series and I'd really appreciate your likes, your favourites, your comments of course, and if you do like the video, share it with as many people as you can. Help spread the word about the channel, it helps me out so much. I really appreciate it guys. Bye for now, Minx Links.
I'll see you on my next video. Bye for now. So tell me, uh, who's your favorite LP cat? Jack and paper planes, go in your closet, take a snapshot with fatal frames. Ain't no place that like comes Silent Hills where she's hanging out. Creeping through the fog, hope to God it's not your paper route. Plasma cut is studded when it busts in the dead of space. Stay cool, sway away, so tough without your fucking face. Another day, another game to conquer, just to say the least. Queen of less plays, oh.